happy day after Thanksgiving where we all regret eating as much as we did. Just kidding, I don't regret it. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Stephanie and I just really love makeup. Um, I'm super excited and to ignore my brows. I dyed my hair darker, so I've been doing my brows darker, but I don't know if that's really needed, so. Also, I, you know, always say that I'm in for a really neutral brow, but, or a really natural brow, but now I'm feeling the not natural brow. I don't know. It's hard being, it's not hard for me. <laughs> anyway, I'm super excited today because I'm going to be testing out the Kim Kardashian Mario, the artist in the muse collaboration. Super excited for this. Um, I got everything. I already took it out of the box because I had to travel, so I wanted to leave room. Um, I have the blush, lipstick, gloss, and a lip liner in the eyeshadow palette. So I think I'm just going to dip right in. I didn't put any blush on. I have a little bit of highlight, but no blush. So I'm going to get jump, just jump straight in. Super excited. Ignore the lighting. I am away for Thanksgiving. Um, I am at my family's beach house, so I don't have the best lighting in this little room, so you're going to have to bear with me. <laughs> but um, I'm going to start with my eyes. Um, or no, I'm going to start with my cheek. I don't know. If, you're, if you are interested, just keep on watching. Okay, so I'm going to start with the blush. Oh, pretty. This is in the shade Very Graceful. And it looks like this. It's got a little mirror on it. To me, it looks like a nice peachy, rosy pink. So let's see. I'm just going to take a Morphe E4. I don't know how pigmented this is, so I probably should have waited on that. But let's just jump there right in. Oh, pretty. This is definitely my type of shade. If you see glistening, it's because I put highlight on first and then realized that there was a blush. It's pretty. That's a really pretty shade. Love that. That's definitely my type of shade. I really gravitate towards peachy, corally shades like that. Oh, now we're seeing some pigment, sister. Now we're seeing it. Probably shouldn't have put that much on, but we're going to roll with it. <laughs> I'm going to take a Morphe. This is just um, kind of a slim, big, fluffy brush, and I'm just going to blend everything together. It's a really pretty shade, though, and it looks really pretty on the skin. Perfect. Okay, moving right into the eyes. I'm going to start off with, I'm going to put Look Up. It looks like look up. I'm gonna mix look up and don't move. It's this cooler toned. I'm really into mixing, so let's just roll with it, people. I want to test out as many shades in here as I can. You know that'll come up with a cohesive look because I am going somewhere today. Okay, so I just dipped in there. It was a little bit powdery, but not bad. Stuff like that doesn't bother me. And then I'm just going to place this all over. Um, okay, so next I'm going to jump right in. I think I'm going to mix Glam King and I'm inspired. So this guy and this guy. Look. So same with those ones, a little bit of powder, but not like anything crazy that would, should bother you. I mean, I guess if you're that type of person. I'm going to pack it on the outer corner and I really like to like... Just get it really good and in on my lower lash line right here. And then I'll start to bring it up. And whatever's left on the brush without dipping in again, I'll run through my crease. Going back in with the original brush I used, I'm so sorry, I didn't even mention I to put the look up and don't move shade on. The first two shades I used, I used a Morphe M441. 
and I'm just gonna go back in with this guy not putting any additional product on and um, blend over what I just did okay pretty I think I really want to use this Mario's Muse shade all over the lid. I think that'd be really pretty and it matches this. It's like a really pretty uh, cranberry, golden cranberry shade. So let's just roll with it. I'm all about rolling with it. So I'm going to take a Morphe um, flat shader brush, just looks like this, and I'm going to dip into Mario's Muse. I'm not seeing a lot come off on the brush. So I think I'm gonna go in with my finger. Tap my finger. Oh yeah, way better. Shade. So what I'm going to do is run over everything again with the brush that I used to put on Glam King and I'm inspired, not putting any additional product, just going over so there's no harsh lines. So that's really pretty, but I want to deepen up the outer corners and there's not a shade, a brown shade in here deeper than um, I'm inspired. So I'm going to grab, I'm going to grab my um, Jaclyn Hill palette really quick and I'm just going to take a small dome brush and I'm going to dip into a deeper shade, probably this chocolate one right here, um, just to get a little bit deeper. I'm going to run it just in like the outer V. Okay, so I just made the outer V a little bit deeper with a shade in the Jaclyn Hill palette, but I'm still liking the KKW palette. I think I'm good with how it turns out, with how it is right now. So, actually, you know what I want to do? I'm going to put a little bit of this shade in here. It's called a beauty campaign. It's the, sorry, I don't want the mirror to get in there. It's like a, if I could describe it, a champagne -y gold, pinky champagne -y color. So I think it'd go really pretty with this shade that's on all over my lid right now. So what I'm gonna do, pop this jack with the lid down. I'm going to take another flat top brush that I have and I'm going to pop this on the brow bone and then in the inner corner. I think it'll look really pretty if I just add a little pop. Inner corner highlight really makes a difference. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, so I'm going to pop on some lashes and I'll be right back and we will put on the lipstick and gloss. I'm super excited. I swatched these and they look really pretty. So I'll be right back. Okay. I am back. I put some lashes on. These are the Tati Lashes in the style TL3. I love these. They're so beautiful. Okay. So, um, now I'm going to put on some lipstick. Okay. So, first off, I'm going to start with the lip liner. This is in the shade Beauty Icon. I swatched it, so it's a little... I'm going to put this on. 
Oh, very smooth. Very smooth and creamy. Now I'm gonna go straight in with the lipstick. This is in the shade He's a Mixer. lighter nudes <laughs> the light okay Also, this is a matte, um, so it's obviously not going to be shiny right off the bat. So that's why it's more of a dry formula because it's a matte. Um, so now what I'll do before I, before I put the gloss on is I'll take my ring finger and around the edges and in the... I'll just run my finger over everything to further... Um, blend it together. All right, now we're going to take the gloss. This is in the shade Proud of You. It's like a true nude gloss. It's like a peachy, you can't see that. <laughs> peachy nude gloss. Oh. So smooth. is like buttery smooth oh my god we have come to the end of the video and i'm here to give you my conclusion my final thoughts on the kkw mario uh the artist and the muse collection um i love the blush i love the lipstick the gloss and the lip liner i think those are all really great um the lipstick is a really great nude color um and I really enjoy that. As far as the palette goes, I thought it was good. Um, the shadows blended very well. It's got beautiful colors in here. The only thing I wish is that there was a shade darker than this I'm Inspired color, um, just to give it one more shade to expand the, what am I trying to say? Expand the amount of looks you can do. So you could do very natural. There was one shade deeper. You could do very smoky looks like the one that I have today. I just had to dip into another palette to get a little bit of a darker shade. Um, I know that this shade up here, the artist, um, is a deeper shade, but when I'm doing like a, a warm eye, which is what I did with these four down here, um, and look up these four right here, um, I don't necessarily always want to dip into a black or a navy that looks like a navy shade. Yeah, I don't always want to dip into that. So if there was one brown shade, it's just a little bit deeper, I'd be super, super happy. But I still think it's a great palette. Um, I think it's fun. I think the colors are fun. And I think you could do um, really pretty looks with it. Um, I love the mario's muse shade i think that's probably my favorite shade that's the one i put all over the lid that matches my sweater so yeah i think it's a really really awesome collection um my personal favorites if i was going to say what you should buy out of it um obviously if you want to buy it all i love that um but definitely the lip gloss is like my hands down favorite the um, lip gloss, lipstick, lip liner, and blush. Those are my four favorite things. I like the eyeshadow too, but if I was like just loving something, it'd definitely be those four. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all had a happy Thanksgiving and um, I hope you enjoy the rest of the week with your family and it's just full of love, blessings, and happiness. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in my next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe so you never miss a video. And I'm gonna go shopping. So, like I need anything else from buying for others.
that's what it's about. <laughs> Bye, guys.